Hi everyone, it's James from Eurovision Island, back for another episode of Review in 2, where I have two minutes, or less, to talk about other songs heading to Rotterdam for Eurovision. Today we're going to take a look at Serbia, Hurricane and Asta La Vista. Now, Serbia have only been in Eurovision for a little over ten years, but during that time I think they've really established themselves as a force to be reckoned with at the contest. I mean, let's face it, debut win, only Switzerland can claim that as well, but also they're one of these countries that consistently get into the final. In fact, there are only three times in history that Serbia haven't made it to the final. Two of those times they came 11th, so you think, well, okay, they were very nearly there. The other time they came 10th. Now, some of you are thinking, well, if they were 10th, why weren't they in the final? That was, of course, back in the early, mid-2000s, when the juries could select an entry and put that forward, so Serbia was in 10th, they missed out. Looking at the song this year, Hasta La Vista, it's one of these, you know, up-tempo pop songs, but it's, you know, falling out of love, but instead of, you know, oh, I'm falling out of love, I'm so sad, it's, hmm, bash me a It's very aggressive, very sultry, but the effect is just brilliant. Staging-wise, fantastically choreographed, very slick, very modern. It's the kind of entry that, you know, you wouldn't think was out of place on a Pussycat Dolls album, or indeed concert. As I said, that staging is very slick, very memorable as well, and where it's one of the only up-tempo songs we have this year, I think so, but you don't have to worry about qualifying. I think it's going to go straight into the final. Once it gets there, it'll be interesting to see what it's up against, but I think in terms of qualifying, if this doesn't come within the top five of semi-final two, then I'd be really, really surprised. Okay, those are my thoughts on Serbia. Keep checking back to Eurovision Island for more episodes of Review 2. Hvala lepa, do vidjenja.